What's up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of the <clears throat> Knowledge Bomb. Boom! What's up? Episode 451. Now, I started following this guy named Ricky Stanzi, who was a quarterback at the D1 level. He either played at Iowa or Michigan State. I better look it up. He's not going to see this, so I think we're going to be good. Anyway, he has some things called the go-to movements, which help with hips and athletes and glute me, glute men, and a bunch of these different things that he puts up on Instagram. And so I started messing with this one movement. A lot of us, you know, that squat and lunge a lot have a hard time getting activation on the outside of the glutes. Now, this looks a little goofy at, at first, but stay with me for a second. Now, another thing that a lot of athletes and a lot of weightlifters have problems with is the QL. The QL is in your low back, but that helps. If that's tight, it fucks, it fucks up your glute activation. So what I saw him doing with some of his athletes was this. They get on the outside of their feet and they dump their QLs. Now, when I mean dump your QLs, that means you're bent over so the QLs are kind of in a stretch position. Now, what they're doing is they're bowing their legs out too and then they're internally rotating and extending. So, you're going here, internal rotation, extending out, and so you're flexing hamstrings, glutes, pressing out now this right here looks kind of goofy I'm not gonna I'm not gonna lie but your lower backs kind of hurting your hips and your glutes feel like they're not on this rotation right here will actually turn a lot of that shit on and open it up and then when you stand back up the QLs get re-engaged I know I can't wait to watch this video back it probably looks crazy but I started doing this a little bit before I squatted because I saw him doing it with athletes and the go-to movement has a bunch of unique stuff like this so you should check it out on Instagram and it's just a little hack for an extra warm-up maybe 25 to 50 reps but you won't feel it until you get on the outside of your heels and you actually kind of round your back so right there that right there already I can feel because we we went super heavy and did a bunch of shit yesterday but as soon as I rotate in and flex out you can feel that whole kind of chain so i don't even know what to call this but it's another hip ql glute mead activator give it a try later <laughs> 